Okay. Hello there, mortals. I am Yinsen. Welcome to another game on Game Jolt Happy Hills Homicide. I have no idea what this game will entail. Let's fire into it. Tape one, edge of your seat. I am a little bit on the edge of my seat. So, as opposed to the game I literally just played a few minutes ago, The Rain Man, which should be up on my channel before this one goes up, this one you actually get to be the serial killer. Ooh, Led Zeppelin. But it's also kind of like in a, a charming little flash area. Red Rum, that's a reference to the hotel horror. Oh, I took the ladder. I thought I was going to, I don't know, climb it. Okay, let's put this ladder over here. Great. Now let's climb up. Hello? Z okay, he's sleepy. We are fast. How are you today? Yeah, no, I'm good. I've, it's, it's been a long day, but ultimately I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with my life. Gotta be said. I mean, like, it's, 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 it's a good existence being a, a full-time clown murderer, but, y you know, it, it definitely has its rewards. Man, damn, you're a heavy sleeper. What a go. Incredible box game changer is the best mod. I find, like, a uh, red flux on Minecraft to be the best mod. Also, I'm talking to chat for anybody watching uh, at home, and we were kind of, like, talking about our biggest fears recently. I'm going to be starting Subnautica in a about a week's time, maybe even less, and I'm terrified of the ocean. I'm genuinely very scared of the ocean. It is one of the scariest things that I've encountered on this planet. Okay. We've got a kitchen knife. Okay, Z to kill. Let's do it. So I was talking about how kind of like being a clown murderer is, is, is quite, it's quite a rewarding occupation, gotta be said. Huh! Uh, but like, you know, there are some downsides, of course. Huh! Huh! Obviously the mess and uh, the cleanup afterwards. Oh. Huh! Oh! Oh! You have no idea just how hard it is to get blood out of a clown's mask. Huh! But anyway, how are you doing these days? Huh! Huh! The Happy Hills Homicide. You have to find the Markiplier secret when you play it? Subnautica, I definitely will. Okay, tape two, Spark of Joy. It's like a puzzle game. It's like a murderer's puzzle game. I love this. This is awesome. Let's search the gnome. We found some keys. Well, that was quick. I actually just wanted to take the gnome itself. And we lost the keys. Easy come, easy go, huh? Can we just like climb up these? Yeah, we can actually. Hello? All right, let's go find a toaster. Oh. All right, she's in the bathtub right beside us, by the way. She's just over my face right over here. Like, just give her a wee kiss. <laughs> what a weird bit that was. Oh, we are actually gonna throw. Okay. I've even got a good one-liner lined up for this as well. I think it's natural. Yeah, it is, it is a bit natural, isn't it? To be afraid of the ocean, gotta be said. How much can you buy your mask for, bud? Totally not trying to let the FBI know who you are. Uh, I'll tell you what. You're gonna have 200 bucks. That is a low ball, by the way. This thing is well used, it's got a lot of history, but every single murder that I do, I will be increasing the price by 100 bucks. How does that sound? Kiss the girl from The Little Mermaid? She is 16, probably? Okay. All right. I'm gonna get on the other side so we can get like the the best, the best view. Do we want it? Do we want a one-liner, big fat one-liner? Live, laugh, toast your bath! Oh! Oh! Damn! Tape three, lawn enforcement. This game's sick. There's a lawnmower here. Good grief! What is this, Sinister Two? Ha! Ah, what a game, actually. That was no, not a game. That was a good film. That was shocking. It was a little bit shocking. Oh, I don't want him to see me. Let's stay in the shadows over here. You can't see us behind this tree, right? All right, he's snipping his hedges. I wish guys on Tinder did that. Just trim their bush every now and then. It's such a shame when guys on Tinder don't trim their bush. Like it's not that hard. Just trim your bush. All right, we've got a bear trap here. Oh, I see where this is going. So, okay, what I'm kind of like gonna be theorizing, and this is just a theory, a game theory, is that we're gonna put this bear trap in this guy's uh, walking path, right? Like right here. And then, as soon as he gets bear trapped, we're gonna go off, we're going to start up the lawnmower, and we're gonna uh, uh, kind of give him a nice big shave. Ah! No! No, his leg! Ah! Okay. 
Do we get in this? No. What do we do now? We didn't even kill the guy. There's another one. There's another bear trap in here. There's nothing really to interact with. Maybe we just break his neck. Melanie Martinez. Oh, I love Melanie Martinez. Hello. I'm taking your key now. It's got a little fox foot onto it. Hey, where have we all seen the Halloween remakes by Bloomhouse? The last one I found, or maybe it was the second one, was so disappointing when that guy was like laying on the second floor in the stairwell and his head was hanging through and Mike Myers just like, not Austin Powers Mike Myers, but Michael Myers that this game is very clearly inspired by, like turns around, looks at him and just twists his, his neck. They missed such a good opportunity just to show how beastly Michael Myers actually is just by taking one hand and just going crack on his chin. What a wasted opportunity. Ah, oh, okay, we're gonna ride the mower. And here we go! Going down in the blades of glory! Oh! Oh, the gore! Well, the mask is 400 bucks now. Wait, you like melatonin martini? I love Melatonin Martini. Um, oh, what's my favorite song? It's not Cry Baby. I think it's like Porcelain Princess or something like that. It's been a, I can't really remember names of songs. I identify music by the album cover. I'm back, what did I miss? Three murders, Teardrop, you missed three murders. We could break a window here. Okay, let's break a window here. I knew it, I knew that was gonna absolutely cost us stealth. Okay, what else is there? So there's break window. We can't go anywhere else. No, definitely. Oh, we gotta wait for the thunder. You've been thunderstruck. Okay, we're inside. They have a dog though, that's... There he is. No! Try again, okay, fine. Uh, do you mean dollhouse? Uh, I'll let you know like after this episode, I think. I'll check out a compendium of music. Okay, we'll climb up. Uh, we can't go that way. I think we just have to close the gap for the dog, right? No, I actually know what we're supposed to do. We gotta wait for the thunder, and we gotta walk in its in its thunder. Like that, right? It's like red light, green light. We probably could have closed that gap way faster. Upstairs. Okay, good. Uh, this guy is washing one single armpit like it's going out of style. Gross, man. Come on. Okay, we got take matches. Buddy, get a haircut. I don't know what that is referring to. I'm going to the trilogy tour in London soon and I'm very excited. Nice! I am going to go see Alpha Wolf soon and I'm really excited about that. Okay, we got some matches. We're not gonna kinda like... Okay, we're not gonna kinda like siphon a bunch of petrol into the water tank and then light it ablaze, are we? Because I'm pretty sure he will smell it. I don't know if we can pass the dog either. I suppose we're about to find out, but we did just get some keys. Okay, we can actually close a lot of that gap with what we've got. So we can't leave. We have to do the red light, green light with Doggo. Hello, Doggo. I think we just got to walk past him, right? Oh, the thunder's decided to stop working. Okay, good. Yeah, we can close quite a bit of a gap. Okay, and we continue onwards. Excellent. The gasoline, wonderful. It's exactly what I thought it was gonna be like. Don't kill Doggo, we're not killing Doggo. I've learned my lesson from John Wick. I didn't have to kill any dogs. To know, never kill a man's dog. Okay, good, let's kill the owner. Hi, friendo. Don't tell me we actually have to kill the dog. You are taking the piss. Now there's gotta be a different, yes. Oh, it's exactly what I thought it was gonna be like. Okay, we're putting petroleum into the water boiler, and now we are going to light them ablaze. What the hell? Oh, we... Oh, we, got, we can hit the light. Hit the light? Ooh! Ooh! Cabin Fever! That is an awesome movie. If no one's seen Cabin Fever, it is definitely worth a watch. Even the the two like sequels, Cabin Fever 2 and 3. 
was still pretty good, considering uh, just how well the first one did as well. I want to do that? What, you want to light somebody on fire? This game's free on itch.io if you actually do want to do that. All right, we've got some paint. That's fine. I tried to do the Lunchbox Friends handshake in the canteen with my friend, but I got punched in the face before I could finish. Yep. Melanie Martinez definitely has a lot of kind of like mental health awareness. Get the hell out of here. Okay, bye-bye. Get the hell out of here. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, bye-bye. So we got it. Oh, we got to paint the window. We died! Oh no. That sucks. Okay, so we'll get some of the paint from over here. And then we'll cover the window. I don't know if we're supposed to like run him over with that truck right there, or if we're supposed to drag his body into that outhouse and then drown him in his own in his own fecal matter. Which is just disgusting. I don't know why I even said anything. Ah, got him. Nice. We're gonna get this chainsaw right here. Excellent. Or excrement. We'll find out very, very shortly. I'm gonna see if there's anything else we're supposed to interact with. Yes! Break bottle. Hide. Fine. Ugh. By the way, the mask is now 500 bucks. If anyone wants to buy it. Hello there, sir. Do you have time to talk to us about our Lord and Savior? The chainsaw? Glory killed! Nice. We're going to get a bunch of ammo and health pickups for that one. Happy Hills Vice. Oh, this is kind of like Miami Vice. What the hell? Oh, neat! Morning, Brian. This is a messy one. Cool. Now we're investigating ourselves. I love this so much. This is so cool. Inspect. What is this? He took the knife from here. Yes, he did. He took the knife from here, and then he just openly stabbed somebody with it. He broke into this window. Point of entry, yes. And I am rough. Oh, what a mess that is. Sick bastard. 16 stab wounds. At least he left the, the murder weapon. That's going to make conviction really easy. Take a photo of the victim. Uh, sure. Snap. Okay, it's the Happy Hills homicide. This getting Brian Pawalski. Brian Pawalski, victim name, Gordon Baker, cause of death, 16 stab wounds. Criminal record, production and distribution of underage pornography, stalking playgrounds. Notes, killer takes murder weapon from victim's house, sadistic power display, no signs of struggle, random victim more carefully chosen. Are we a vigilante? That'd be so cool. Victim was supposed to be found, political message, written in blood. I am rough. 16 stab wounds, agony are personal. Yes, they are indeed. Cool. Are we gonna investigate all of them? What microphone do I use? I use a Rode NT USB. And I also know the six necessary filters that you uh, kind of, they're, they're required reading for YouTube to uh, have a really, really good audio quality. They're, um, what are they? Uh, compressor, equalizer, uh, 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 I've forgotten them all. I've forgotten all of the other ones. Okay. I mentioned them actually in the last Delta Room stream that I did. So if anybody actually does want really, really good mic quality, check that out. Or you can go and look up Harris Heller's guide on how to do it. Well, I figured that mechanic out real fast. Happy Hills Cargo. Door is locked. It's fine. I'll find a key somewhere. Ah, there's a crowbar right here. Why would I need a key? I can just use brute force. All right. Good. Uh, we can probably actually just pass under the spotlight without fear of being caught, right? We're going inside. Happy Hills Cargo. This guy is asleep on the job. He deserves to die. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, no, I'm just a clown murderer. All the voices in my head, they, uh... I wanted to be something cooler, but... Clown murderer is what I got stuck with. Yeah. I bet you didn't want to be a security guard when you were a kid, either. I wanted to be a mime. So I suppose I'm pretty close, honestly. But if you wanted to be an astronaut, you're completely buggered. Anyway, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go murder someone. Um, I'll see you around, bud. What a guy, huh? What a nice holistic guy. Okay, we'll come through here. We got a nail gun. Excellent. Why are we killing the guard? Maybe we are actually a vigilante. That would be such an awesome twist, by the way. Okay, uh, a good, a good one-liner. We need it. We need a good one-liner. Swallow my past load. <laughs> Tape 
seven. Don't drop the soap. Now, nail guns actually have um, a little rubber stopper on the end of them that you have to pull back for it to actually arm the nail gun. You can't actually just discharge a nail gun, like an actual gun. Let's call Evil Yinsen and see if he answers. Did him right here. That's actually so cool. It is, isn't it? This is a really cool game. It's getting a sequel as well. Uh, somebody requested that I play the sequel, but only the demo is out. Hey, buddy. What's up? Piss off. No mascots. I'm going through. Okay. Uh, your guns are looking absolutely fine, by the way, bro. Love those gains. It's, it, you're, never, you're never too evil to compliment somebody on their work, right? Suit up. Okay. All oh, right, now he's not going to know that we're a... <laughs> what an idiot. What an idiot. All those steroids are rotting his brains. Taking the soap. Yum, yum. Delicious, tasty treat. Someone is naked. Yeah, but we don't actually get to see their puzzle or anything like that. I feel like Copperbolt, the guys who made these games, or guy who made this game, I feel like they definitely are tasteful in their application of horror. Okay, I'm just going to sit here then. Wow, this is like some Final Destination level of, of murder here. Oh, don't tell me we kick it now. Oh! This is so awesome. Uh, we need a one-liner. We need a one-liner. Um, swallow my stool. <laughs> ah! Die! 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 D you didn't hear the uh, joke I made about the stool, did you? Well, that's going to be a weird one to investigate. Just relax. Okay, we're going into the next one. I love this game so much. Like, I'm I'm a sucker for puzzle games, and I'm also a sucker for side-scroller investigations. Right, we have to go in. What is the mechanic of this place? They have uh, two adults and a child, or a really, really short adult. Is this an office? There's so many computers. What a crap in here. Okay, this is a to go upstairs. Let's go up here. Oh, it is an office. Okay, we can go back downstairs. Let's try to turn the power off for this place. And then I'm pretty sure we gotta like hide by the stairs, right? We gotta hide in the in the stairwell. Or maybe we don't. Maybe he actually turns around. I love the little Rainman, it's so effective. Oh, uh, it was Rainman. We're actually playing something else. I'll tell you what, I'll change that right this second because it, it shouldn't be Rainman. Happy kills homicide. And I'm, you know what, I'm going to put a cat face right after that as well. Like a, there we go, a, a cute little cat face. <laughs> That'll attract all of the wrong people. Oh no, what have I done? <laughs> uh, bring my streaming software so I can see chat as well. There we go, I changed Rainman. Yay! Yeah, 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 people have to remind me, i got memory issues. Okay, this guy is buggering off, he's done photocopying a bunch of crap. Do we hide in here? Yes. Right, where is he? Just kind of want him to come back past, don't we? We don't want to be caught straight up. Hey, bye. Okay, don't want to hide in there. We want to find some stuff to grab. Oh, nice, a fire axe. What? Oh, this is a bit crude. I'm coming. No, oh, damn it. <laughs> I said it was a bit crude, but I didn't realize just how kind of like fiddly the stealth mechanics were with that guy. So this entire bottom section of the map is a nothing burger, which is pretty funny actually, because there's burgers all over the place. All right, we're hovering in the shadows like a creep, which is absolutely fine. This guy's going to be photocopying, and then he's going to be off photoshopping, something like that. Who cares what he's doing, honestly? I'm going to hide in here, and then we'll wait for him to go all the way to the end. I think we'll leave here, and then we'll go grab the axe, and then we'll dip into that exact same room that we were just in. We've probably actually got enough time to do so. Here we go. So he's going to be Photoshop, good photocopying for a wee bit. We probably got to sneak up behind him while he's photocopying, right? All right. I'm gapping it. Good. Why isn't anyone else typing? Did they ever call Evil Yinsen and die? Well, I don't think die is the right word. I don't think, I definitely don't think die is the right word. Uh, Merry Xmas! Oh, the photocopier is actually photocopying his face. His bloody face. 
Oh, that is grim. I can't hear. Try turning your sound up. Number one fan. More like Zemus. <laughs> haunted house. Hey, ladies. You, uh, you having fun at my haunted house? This is my day job, by the way. This is sick and twisted, you guys. I'm here because I, I am the Chris. You're late, dude. Go to work, dude. Oh, that's not... That's misinformed. Hey, there's a Mike Myers mask. There's a, a ghost face mask. And there's also, we can see, a Jason mask. Not a Jason mask from Friday the 13th. A Jason mask from Friday the 13th to and onwards. Hey, girls. Why are we stopping? Uh, 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 uh lame. You're not scary. Okay. What's upstairs? A screwdriver. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay. What are we doing with this fan? This is... I thought we were just going to use the... Okay, bye-bye. He's trying to kill us. I can't get the seatbelts off. It's not my fault. Fix malfunction. Oh, that's embarrassing. Uh, I'll be right back, ladies. You you stay right there. I'll 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 be right back. Oops, that's embarrassing. <laughs> A brief intermission. Oh! Mask is seven hundred bucks now. All right, lights out. Tape ten. No, 800 bucks. We just got two kills. Door is locked. Damn it, can't we kick it in? All right, there's a lot of beers out here. We can peek this window. You already killed Tyler and Chad. He will come for us now, for sure. Right, let's waste this bastard. So yeah, we are actually a vigilante killer. We're not just like some psychopathic clown murderer. Hmm. Okay, so. Let's go out. They probably have left that window open for a reason. We probably have to get the keys from one of these two directions. Where are you? Piss off! I've been shot! Okay, I'll try again. I'll try again. I bought it already when it was at zero dollars. Yeah, this is a free game. This is a free game. Is it weird that I feel bad for these people? I am a vigilante killer! The first guy was a pedophile! Why would you feel bad for a pedophile? Okay, we'll come out here. I, it's weird that we kind of have to peek into this window just to kind of get the lay of the land. We are going to hit the power. Uh, we're going to go in through the right next time. I was trying to go up the stairs, but either that guy shoots on a time limit or he shoots like when we get too close to him. Uh, let's try to go this way then. Oh, there's no one in here. Oh, perfect. Well, this is not going to alert them whatsoever. I love how this thin piece of tin is actually going to save us. Oh, we got him! Well, technically, he got him. I know you're there, asshole. I'm taking this key right here. Uh, let's go downstairs. We could probably take that guy's gun, but I, I I, don't really want to, right? How did it feel to get shot? Uh, not amazing, not gonna lie. It did not feel amazing to get shot. It kind of felt like, uh, you know, I was shot. Uh, we need some kind of, like, gun, right? Okay, let's take this again. There's got to be a better thing to lean this up against. Maybe not. Hmm. Huh. Okay, I'm going inside. It seems like we don't really have any... Oh, perfect! Nice! Let's go ahead and climb up here. That'll do the trick! You guys see that? The gigantic machete! We'll take the machete. Yes! Machete improvise. Okay. And... Down here, and now up onto the ladder. I've got a one-liner as well. I've got one. Are we are we ready for this one-liner? All aboard the jungle brews! Oh! Oh! I want one of those. They're actually pretty cheap. You can get one for about twenty bucks. What I want is one of those log-splitting swords. I saw one of those on a YouTube short. And I got addicted to it immediately. Morning, Brian. Nasty murder. Burned alive. Okay, so this is the guy in the shower, right? 
We're not doing all of this across a night, are we? Wait a minute. So there was evidence in here. Isn't this where we got the gasoline? No. How would we know that? We don't actually... We didn't commit these murders. Allegedly. 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 Okay. Z to inspect. Ripped cloth. Must be the killers. What if we are actually this... This detective right here and he's just like purposefully doing a bad job. Okay. We want to go this way. This is the boiler. Yes. The boiler reeks of gasoline. Doesn't it just... I've been trying to lose the dream. Best of luck. I am retribution. Okay. Burned alive. Some sort of statement. I mean, hanging them up by the shower curtain rails would probably be a bit of a statement. Take a photo. Investigator. Brian Pawlowski. Victim name. Hank Wallace. Causes of death. Burned alive. Criminal record. Drunk driving and arson. Oh, that's fitting. No suit. No basic murder weapon. Killer is creative and sadistic and enjoys killing. Ripped cloth belongs to a janitor suit. No DNA matches. Another message in blood. I am retribution. Looks like acts of revenge. Does the killer know the victims? Both victims have criminal records. Killer thinks they deserved it. Vigilante? Maybe. 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 Death from below. I vibe this game so hard. This is so much fun. Okay, death from below. Have we all seen, um, yeah, the second. Cool. Have we all seen the second, um, uh, Friday the 13th film? Where Jason kind of like sticks the machete through the floorboards and gets the guy in the foot. Okay. Good. Good. We can't move around while we're submerged, unfortunately. Okay, we're actually caught in a little bit of a bad spot here. We've got to distract this guy somehow. I don't know how we would distract him. I don't know if we could perhaps find some kind of thing to throw. Maybe? This one is the hardest? Yeah, it does seem that way, doesn't it? Maybe we're just supposed to get spotted, and then we kind of, like, dip dive, duck dive, and dodge. I genuinely can't tell if I have a minor trauma from watching a DDLC mod, but I'm probably overreacting. I was a little bit trauma- oh, Damn it. I was a little bit traumatized when I first played DDLC myself. I could probably actually play the DDLC Plus on the channel. Because I haven't played DDLC Plus. I played the original one. Trust me, it is. Yeah, no, I definitely trust you. I can already see that this is going to be a tricky one. Okay. So, he lowers his shotgun. We don't want to be touched by it. I'm dipping low. And then I'm going to bring it up slow. Ah! Okay. I know the technique now. Huh? Nice try, buddy old pal. I'll pose. Okay, we want it to go down even further. Good. And now we keep going. Okay, it's red light, green light. I've got, I've got the skills. I've got the skills to get the kills. It's a good thing we can actually see this torch from, uh, from underwater. Otherwise, we'd be in a really bad spot. Okay, I think that we can just, like, gap it through here now. Okay, Fishing Master is now absolutely toast. Now we've probably got to play Red Light, Green Light just one more. You should play it. Uh, DDLC Plus? I probably will. I probably will on the channel. I've been trying to get my girlfriend into the, uh, the voice acting as well. Because she needs a hobby at the moment. All she does is doom scroll these days. And I feel like she is made for content creation. Yeah, this is Yenset I'm talking about, by the way. Uh, it just based on how she, um... She's a theatre kid. It's just like a natural theatre kid. Huh? Wait a minute, can we just... Huh? Huh? Oh, I think we... I've found an exploit. <laughs> I found an exploit, that's so funny. Alright, um... Uh, uh, uh one-liner. We need a one-liner, guys. We need a one-liner. We need a one-liner. We need a one-liner for this kill. How about... Uh... Taste my poon clang! Sorry, I think I ruined the the satisfaction of that kill with that one-liner. Motel California. Now that's a pun I can get behind. Awesome! Very good! We're at the Bates Motel. That's funny. That's a uh, psycho reference. Now this is what I call a swordfish. You shall become the fish. Damn, they would have been so much better than eat my pooned clang! <laughs> Why did that one cross my mind? 
Oh, I can't believe my brain. All right, we're going inside. I found some keys and a half-eaten hamburger. That's uh, pretty cash money, actually. Just leaving rotting food around the place is absolutely a power move. Who's in here? What the hell is in that TV? Oh, is that the ring? Oh, that's so funny. That's so funny. So Samara is currently, like, out in the world. And this is her, this is that tape. That will kill you in seven days. No room service. Thank you. Okay. Wait until she is asleep. Sure. What about this one? There's a coat hanger here. Okay. We're going to murder somebody with this coat hanger somehow. Uh. Do I literally just have to stand out here? Yo, would you be able to sleep with a clown standing outside of your bedroom window? Minus a thousand aura. <laughs> yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> it's a minus a thousand aura. I think I literally just dropped 10 charisma points. Someone just hit my car? My car! Stop that! I hope that's my car. I've got the keys for it. Okay. Just wait? Yeah, I thought so. I thought we'd have to wait. Although we probably also have to disable the alarm so that they can get to sleep. I don't know about you guys, but when there's a car alarm going off, uh, quite literally 20 meters from where I'm trying to sleep, it's really hard for me to um, get to sleep. All right, here we go. All right, what's her crime? Why is she at this motel? What is she running from? Um. Okay, so it's called the Bates Motel, right? Uh, good one-liner. Um. A good one-liner for the Bates Motel. We got one liner, one liner. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Help me out here. One liner. All I've got is like master bait jokes, and I don't want another one of those kind of uh, debacles we had with that fisherman. Come on, give us a one liner. And it can't be swallow this. We've already used that one. We've already used that one. Uh, so we've got a coat hanger in a hotel. I'm still waiting. Come on, guys. Come on. Let's get a one-liner. Let's get a one-liner in here. You will become the coach. Yeah, I think none of us expected what... If that uh, not, like literally none of us expected what happened to happen, right? That was a good one, line, no, uh, DJ. Very good, very good. I might steal that one a few more times as well. Might I might steal it while we're uh, still playing this game. All right, we are close. Get out. Uh, no, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I just got inside the cart. I think this. <laughs> I did. I got inside the delivery cart. Hello. Okay, we got to wait for them to like lock up, right? What is the lore of this game? I literally cannot tell what the lore of this game is. Like, why are we murdering everybody? I, I know that we're doing some kind of vigilante justice stuff, and I know that they've done some heinous crimes. How do we know who they are unless we're a direct victim of them or even one of the police officers or detective? Right? It's It's got to be one of those two. I'll be having serious arguments with my friends and they'll pull out that you have a negative 10 gifts, so I'll say you have negative 10,000 aura. That's, that's not very nice. Can we move? <laughs> yeah, no, that was weird. I thought it was going to lock up and we'd have, like, free reign with him. We're close, get out. Uh, that's fine, I'm just gonna get into this cart right here. Okay. All right, he's looking. We are literally playing red light, green light. Okay, he flips the sausage and then he looks. Good. Flippy, flippy. Good, yes, 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 yes. I've got it, I've got it. I've got one for this as well. I've, I've got a one-liner for this one. All right, here we go. We're almost there. Did somebody order room service? Uh, 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 uh. 
what a way to go. What a way to go. Just wait for the end, it'll make sense soon. Okay, awesome. Because you never know with these kind of like indie games whether or not they're actually going to have a complete narrative. Damn raccoons get lost. Yoke. Okay, we got to make this guy step on the rake, right? Bear trap. Oh, I see. Bear trap. Bear trap. Okay, we disabled all of the traps that are preventing our, our egress to murder. Okay, this is like Dale and Tucker versus evil, right? All right, now that we've done... Oh, I see. A pitchfork, too. Very cash money. Right. Can I have some of that pie? <laughs> All right, we're gonna do a high. We're gonna like, we, yeah, okay. Um, I've got a one liner. I've got a one liner for this one. I've got a one liner for this one. I've got a one liner for this one. All right, we ready? Hey. Yeah. Get bailed. Get bailed, son. I couldn't leave it at hey. I love the cowboy hat on top of it. <laughs> Popper Ball has kind of nailed the the like comedy of horror kills, like the 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 satisfaction and relief of horror kills. All right, sleeping on the bus or the train. Oh my god, you literally blew their back out. <laughs> oh, here we are. Oh, there we are. We're, we're here. We're on the back of the bus. Follow her. Do not lose her. So we're not the detective. Hey! <laughs> the one-liner didn't work again. I'm just going to stand in the streetlights. All right, don't lose her. We'll try and avoid the streetlights, right? Yeah, okay. So she's going to keep on turning around. She's going to keep on looking at us. We, we gotta, like, riz her using... Oh, piss. Using stealth. Turn around. How could she not see the clown right in front of her? Lady! You got issues! Yep, there we go. Perfect. This is a really good game. It kind of reminds me a lot of Party Hard, which I might play a little bit of... right after this. Oh, no, she's running! She knows that something is stalking her. She knows that it's a clown that's stalking her. Okay, good. Oh! That was close. Almost just got detected. Oh, okay. I'm hiding. Good, 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 good. She suspects nothing. She suspects nothing. Yes, 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 poos. Oh, no. Okay, we're going all the way through. It's probably going to turn around there. Yes. You're safe in the light, lady. But you're alone in the dark. I'm coming for you! I got a pipe! Oh, okay. Um... She has object permanence issues. Better one-liner for the last. You're the one that's burnt? Okay. Freeze! Ah, so you too would like to hit the pipe. Got you now, you bastard. Stay out of my way, detective! You're under arrest. I will only warn you once! I am death! Damn him! Shoot anyway! <laughs> Take care of our problem. Happy Hills Vice. Okay, another one of the investigation ones. Nice. Okay, this is the guy that got bailed. He went down in a literal hay of gunfire. Hate and death. Is getting more aggressive. You don't say. Well, it's getting better, actually. It's also justice right here. Morning, Brian. Hope your stomach can handle this. So it's got to be one of these two, right? It's got to be one of these two who's the murderer. I imagine that is going to be the case. We've got a bailer here. He likes to kill creatively. Sadistic. Oh, man, everyone needs a hobby, my dude. Inspect. He is on some sort of warpath. Nothing can stop whatever they deserve. Death is their gift. Oh, hey, friendo. Okay, uh, the Happy Hills Homicide Investigator, Brian Pawalski. Victim name, Bill McSawyer. Cause of death, bail maker. Criminal record, zero. That we know of. That was reported. Oh, would you look at that? Weird. 
Victim has no criminal records. Killer is not a vigilante. Why did the victim have to die? What is the connection between the victims? Why does he want revenge? The pale grin. He could return for the girl, Madison Carpenter. She will get protection. Okay. Are you going to be streaming tomorrow? Uh, no. The weekends I spend making edits and I upload those to my channel. I'm still here, by the way. I'm just going to be a little quiet. That's fine, Dale. That's fine. You do you. All right, good. We are still watching. Uh, this cop has to die, unfortunately. He's an enforcer of, of the law. And we are literally walking entropy. Hmm. But I am going to be streaming every single weekday. Every single weekday. So I will be back next week on Monday. I also use New Zealand time. That confuses a lot of people as well. I'll be waiting for your next stream. You'll definitely see it. I like to put uh, alerts on YouTube when I'm about to go live about an hour in advance in the community posts. So if you turn on notifications, you'll get those. Or in the Discord, I've got a channel called Live Alerts, which I also update pretty frequently. I didn't do it today. Probably should have. Okay, let's get in the car with this cop. Got the donuts, Dave? No. Uh, one liner. One liner. One liner. Something is off. What do you mean something is off? Need a one liner. My headset, okay. Bye bye, I'm leaving now. I hope you beat the game. I will, Teardrop, and the whole the full game will be on YouTube as a VOD. You'll be able to watch the entire thing in one setting if you want to finish it off. Bye bye, you have a great day. Or night, whatever time it is. One liner, okay. Oh! Do not donut get up! Uh, oh no, this can take four minutes if you don't know what you're doing. Do these nuts! <laughs> <laughs> Don't he's nuts! <laughs> oh, that is a one-liner that nobody asked for, Red Rux! <laughs> Alright, we're in. Good. She's got a trash can in her house. Is that actually a thing Americans do? Do Americans actually have bags of trash and trash bins in their house? Because here in New Zealand, we keep our bins outside so that they don't stink like, like absolute garbage. And... We also have these bins that we put bin liners in. We put a lid on top of it so it doesn't stink. Uh, so the, the, the trash bags aren't just like lying all over the house. Doesn't make any sense. Okay, we're here. Got a baseball bat right here. Oh, hello! I dodge! I dodge! I dodge! I dodge! Damn, she had terrible aim. We are literally like seven foot tall. I don't know how the hell we, uh, she missed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, we tried. This reminds me so much of the golden era of Flash games. All right, she attacks us. We're gonna do a couple of dodges. We slip that one like Michael Jackson and Thriller. Also slip that one like Michael Jackson and Thriller. This one, we're gonna slip like Michael Z Jackson and Thriller. And this one, we're gonna slip like we're playing Asriel. Let's get the bat, and we want to throw it, right? Boom! Oh, what a hit. What a toss. Where'd the bat go? Ah, oh, that's not our problem. Oh! I'm sorry, Madison. I hope you enjoyed your trip. You were the only kind one. Why did you have to run? I think this lady in particular is weird. Yeah, you're telling me. What's up, Doc? Okay, till, kill Dr. Hawkins. This doesn't feel very good. Oh no, there's a wanted poster of us. Yes, please. I'm gonna take that wanted poster and I'm gonna put it up on my on my wall in my house. Yes, a little bit of memorabilia from some of our hobbies. Never, it's always a good thing, right? Ah, the therapy clown, welcome. Hi. Um, can the doctor see me? I need therapy. <laughs> I'm the one that needs the therapy. Find Hawkins floor first. There's a cop right here. He's actually been investigating us as well. He's been at all of the crime scenes. Door is locked. Go inside to the mail bathroom. Okay. Hello? It's a wanted poster here. Freddy was here. No! Not Freddy Fazbear. No, it was most likely Nightmare on Elm Street's Freddy. Okay, find Dr. Hawkins' floor first. We probably have to go the opposite way. One liner, I'm here for the... <laughs> okay. Just in case no one's actually reading chat. <laughs> no, the only one reading chat. I'll use that one. What the... Yeah, hey, buddy. Nice clown mask. Where'd you get that nice wee suit? How do you get the blood out of it? It's super bright. Well, you have a great day, friendo. 
Okay, we gotta find Dr. Hawkins. Go inside here. What's in here? There is a clipboard. Dr. Hawkins is in surgery right now. That's gonna provide us a lot of access for sharp things. Okay. Uh, so now that we know this, we want to go all the way over here to the elevator. The police officer doesn't really seem terribly phased that we're just walking around here. Upstairs. Surgery. Okay, we're here. Uh, let's try and harass people in the bathrooms first. Hello? Uh, we could dress up as a doctor. To blend in, but it seems as though uh, we don't want no scrubs. Okay. Door locked, door locked. Understood, Dr. Hawkins. Ah, this is Dr. Hawkins. He's wearing golden frame glasses and he's got a ridiculous moustache. Absolutely ridiculous. Don't know why people grow moustaches these days. Okay, we'll go inside. Uh, let's get rid of this poster, obviously. Nice! We got an achievement. We got an achievement? What do you mean we got an achievement? Okay, sorry, sir. Surgeons only. I am a surgeon! In a way. Understood, Dr. Hawkins. Stop calling him by name! Don't you know there's assassins around the place? All right, that nurse is looking real well rested for her job. All right, we're going inside here. Hello, do we unplug this? Maybe, why is there a trash can in here? Doesn't make sense. Okay, so it's kind of hard to find a way to kill Dr. Hawkins, isn't it? Go in here, oh, now we have to dress up with this. Gotcha, sus, <laughs> super sus. <laughs> There's an imposter among goose. Okay, let's go. And just hope that Dr. Hawkins is act- Hey Larry, new haircut? <laughs> uh, this is a defibrillator. These are used to restart people's hearts when they stop or they go into cardiac arrest. I know that because I've had some training in first aid. I love how the clothes don't move with us. It probably would have actually been too hard to time the animation. Okay, so in here, nothing. Whoops, didn't want to- that was weird. We probably would just want to follow Dr. Hawks Hawkins now, right? There he is. Understood, Dr. Hawkins. We need to commit a call out, don't we? We need to commit a call out. Let's see if we can't like get the doctors to go tend to this new patient. There's gotta be like a switchboard or something or maybe we can unplug it or something like that. Doors are locked. There's nothing in there. I went in there, I checked for even but a split second. There is a person in here, I don't, oh, there is actually a plug over here that we can unlock. It is right here. Hide. Okay, behind this curtain. All right, Red Rux, we're gonna use your one-liner as well for this kill. Hello, doctor. I'm here for my prostate exam. Metal Militia. Okay, that's not usually a good thing. Okay, Metal Monday! We'll go ahead and see if there's not anything outside first, because that usually serves us the best. I don't know if that one-liner was the most appropriate for the moment. Like, I get he's a doctor, but we could have done something like, um... Uh... uh, uh, it's, uh it's, 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 you want to see something shocking or something like that? We could have absolutely nailed him with one of those. Hit him with the, how is the power still on if we just turn the power off? I'm back here, DJ. All right, we're in the bathroom segment, but we can't actually go into the bathroom, not even the female bathroom. We could have got some lore if we had. There is a bloody knife on the table right here. Why can't I take that? Looking for me, asshole? Probably. Get him, boys. I'm going for the knife. Hi, buddy. One. Ah, oh, he got me! No! We probably need to go for the pool cube, right? Because it's bigger, it's longer. Get him, boys! Okay, we'll go for the pool cube. We'll hold out with this bad boy. Hello! Nice shot. Nice try. I'm too quick! And I thought I was supposed to be the clown. The weapon broke. That's a fine. There's a knife right here. Damn it! Oh, poos! There are so many of them. There are so many of them coming after us. There's gotta be what, like 10? 10 of them? There's also a bottle over here. Okay, we've got a broken bottle. Hey buddy, here you go. We got a butcher and bolt it seems. Boop. Damn it, we can't get like too close. It is actually pretty fiddly. This one's harder than the boat one, I would say. I would definitely say that. Get him boys. 
Okay, now we gotta do it like a tower defense holdout. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Oh, no, he got me into my puzzle. He cut my puzzle off. That's not very nice. Okay. All right, I got a one-liner. I got a one-liner. Hey, buddy, let me buy you a drink. Hey, buddy, let me buy you a drink. Hey, buddy, let me buy you a drink. Hey, buddy, let me try buy you a drink. Hey, buddy, let me buy you a drink. It's now your cue to die. 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 Ah, piss! My nuts! I died a eunuch. <laughs> he literally cut my nuts off. Get him, boys. Okay, we'll try again. Let me buy you a drink. Oh, no, he just stabbed us straight in the nuts. Was the song Mrs. Potato Kid? Oh, the Melanie Martinez song? I have no idea. I'll have to, like, look it up in between the uh, recordings. Okay, I'm gonna... Let me buy you a drink. Oh, he knew. He knew that I was trying to kill him as well. Bastard. Maybe we should go for the knife. It's actually the hardest one to get to. Get him, boys. What if I just stab him? No, nothing happens. Hey, let me buy you a drink. Hey, buddy, 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 let me buy you a drink. Good. Now it's your cue to die. 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 Fighting oblivion NPCs be like... Oh, I tried to grab the knife! This is hard, actually. This is actually a, a kind of tricky timing puzzle right here. You gotta actually time all of these so that you don't get hit even once. Because even if you miss an attack, you're gonna get killed. A single attack. That's rough. That's actually quite rough. Do you know what the lyrics are? No, couldn't tell you. Uh. Okay, again, you stabbed me in my balls. Straight up the bat. This is a hard one. Oh my god. Get him, boys! Get, get me, boys! Come get me, boys! I'm gonna stab this guy running. There we go. Let me buy you a drink! Hey there, buddy! Let me buy you a drink! Oh, my balls! There's gotta be 15 guys, right? Because we can only get five stabs of each of those items. I don't know if we've seen it in the top left-hand corner. We, we kind of have a limit to the weapons. Let me buy you a drink! Nice. Let me buy you a drink! Hey, buddy! Let me buy you a drink! Okay, lost my balls again. This is really difficult! What the hell? Get him, boys! Okay. Get the bottle first. I'm gonna take this guy out. Here. Okay, that guy got me. It seems as though when they start coming at you, when they start coming at you, you kind of lose the timing of everything, right? So this guy right here. You gotta get them before they actually go down on the ground. Okay, that guy got me. I have a screaming goat when I press it. <laughs> it screams. <laughs> we just call those goats here in New Zealand. Okay, we got one of these. Let me buy you a drink. Hey there, buddy. Let me buy you a drink. Hey there, buddy. Let me buy you a drink. Hey there, buddy. Let me buy you a drink. Hey there, buddy. Let me buy you a drink. Good. Now it's your cue to die. Now it's your cue to die. I am the screaming goat. Get him, boys. While I stand here and smoke. I'm just gonna do nothing. You guys, you guys defend me. Even if it costs 15 of your lives, that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to stand behind the bar and I'm not going to do anything productive whatsoever. I'm not even gonna wash dishes. I'm literally just gonna stand here and smoke this yucky cigarette. It's not even one that I like. Okay, good. I'm gonna stand here and watch this guy murder all of you because that is that is what I do for a living. I'm a, I'm a big bad guy and, and I gotta... Useless idiots! Okay, bye, friend. Oh, crossbow. Nice. Back off! It wasn't me! Uh, okay. Take my shaft! Quiver in fear! I got two, two one-liners out of that one. Do you know when you'll play facade? Probably do it at the end of this stream. Happy Weirs. Oh, well, we are literally on the stand. Is 
Yep, there we are. Good. Excellent. Okay. Have a cross section with a with a but all oh, right crossbody. Yeah. Okay. 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 That was uh, not so bad. Not so bad. I thought it was revolting at first, but it's not so bad. Sledgehammer. What are we gonna do with this? Oh, we're literally just gonna hit him in the head. Oh, that's embarrassing. Flashbang out. I'm okay. I'm fine. He's gone. Spread out. Good thing we've got the sledgehammer, huh? Okay, we're in the West Pine Mall. Happy times shopping. Out there's probably going to be a bad, rude dude. And here is a bathroom. I'm going to hide in the bathroom. Why am I hiding in the bathroom? Oh, I bet that's why. I bet we're hiding in the bathroom because there's a guy with a gun pointing his guns at us. <laughs> From face to paste. Hey, buddy. You too, huh? No, those gobbles didn't really defend you against a lot, did it? What's in here? Nothing. There's no one in here. Okay, good. So, over here, there is a little wing ding that we... Okay, no! Swat this! <laughs> okay. Hey, kids, I'm Larry. Hi, Larry. I'm just uh, murdering everybody in my way. We can break the lock, and now we can go inside. I think there was a part that we may have missed. Ah! 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 My balls! Oh, he shot me in the balls like 20 times! I hope that you have to shop from only Tamu and Shine in Hell. Tamu's not so bad. Tamu's okay. There are a lot worse places to buy things from than Tamu. I'm swatting flies! My balls! Not my balls! I need those so much to live! Okay. We don't want to get the first one. Or the second one. Or these two. Flashbang out! Ah, oh, okay, so we gotta like use this area to hide repeatedly. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay, the alarm's gone off. All right, all right, all right, and they're gonna turn around. Flashbang out! Oh, I should have just like double tap Z. That's the strategy, right? You, you gotta double tap it. I feel like you gotta double tap it. Okay, we're in. And now the SWAT's coming through. Here they come. Flashbang out! Oh, I couldn't, like, dip back in. Have you seen the Timu as where the girl changes races? Yes, I have! I have seen those ads! I posted it on a, YouTube, on a Facebook group called... Uh, uh, I was there when this didn't happen, and people were all like, what do you mean this didn't happen? This sale definitely happened. And I was like, well, I mean, like, the before photos, they're a different race, and the after photos, they're a, they're a different race, so obviously this didn't happen. And they're all like, no, no, you're just you're just a racist guy. This can definitely happen. It was so frustrating. I ended up leaving that group. Screw Facebook. <laughs> Facebook's a pit. A social, literally a social pit. Boop. Okay, we can't. Oh! Okay, so we gotta wait in there until everyone kind of de aggros we got to wait in there until people de, de and then we can start picking them off from here. Watching Dr. Pimple Popper right now? Uh, gross. Okay. I tried to swing the hammer. Didn't even get the kill on that one. This one's fiddly. This one's fiddly. This one is actually very similar to Party Hard. I don't even know if we can go further along. Okay, I did press Z when it had the kind of like kill prompt and it just robbed me of it that time. Instead it just like, uh, it kind of spawned everyone somewhere else and uh, then killed me. I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna be patient with this one, I think. I think we're just being a little bit too, too much. We're being, we're being a little bit too simple. And on they move, good. Yeah, they keep jumping around and respawning in different places. Okay, that's one. Hello there, friendo. Flashbang out! Alright, there should be two more coming down the, the corridor. Or not. Hello? Swat? Ah! Ah! Wait! Oh, they're coming! Oh, Lord, are you coming? 
Hello? Wait, you didn't see the corpses on the ground, my dude? Swat this! Okay. One more guy. Swat's up! Okay, good. We got everybody in this area. Perfect. And all their wishes come true. Oh, Timu, oh, Timu, shop like a billionaire. No, I haven't seen it like a video. I've seen it as, I've seen a billion ads where the before afters are like uh, colored people and then the after photos are usually not colored people. Okay, so we don't want to go in there. Like Facebook is so full of them, especially here in New Zealand. I don't know if we get targeted advertisements here in New Zealand, but some of them are heinous, like really heinous. All right, I don't know where we are. I don't know if we can keep going along here. Go up the stairs. All right, we're in a pretty good place. That door is locked. There's a television here. I don't know what that reference is. So done with this goddamn crap. Okay. Uh, are you ready for the smackdown? It was not ready for the smackdown. Okay, we can break in here. Oh, poos. I'm taking the hostage. Oh my god, that works. I am literally holding a corpse like a puppet master. I didn't realize this was so effective. I'm coming. Oh, I got two with one bullet that time. Whoa, okay, there's only a temporary amount of time you have with the corpse. I swear YouTube gives me so many teeth whitening ads because I live in the UK. That's, uh, not amazing. I get lots of mobile game ads as well. Like, heaps and heaps of mobile game ads. I don't even know why. Most of them are just lies. Like the, um... What's that one where there's kind of like always like a sexy lady and they're sticking like sick people inside of them? This probably sounds ridiculous to anybody who doesn't know what I'm talking about, but anyone who has seen the ads before know exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, the SWAT were here. Ghost face. We don't necessarily have a lot around here, do we? We can drive off in the SWAT van. We probably should. Let's do that. Bang, 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 bang. What's going on with you guys? Don't worry. Sucks to be them. Sucks to be them. I've seen those. Yeah, I know. They're terrible, aren't they? Happy Hills Vice. Okay, more investigation. Okay, nothing here. I'm loving the 80s synth wave. There is a dead cop in that. Here we go. Dang it. Poor Martin. Yeah, poor Martin. He got killed by a one-liner too. So this is actually really far back, isn't it? This is the lady who tripped down the stairs. Remorse. Was this an accident? I'm sorry. No, it was not an accident. I think that uh, she was just kind of related maybe to the guys that he's actually hunting down. A knife with her fingerprints. She fought back. A class group photo of Madison West Pine High. Ah, wait a minute. These are most of the victims. Ah. That school burned down a year ago. This all connects. It does now. All victims West Pine, West Pine High School or had a job there. That school burned down a year ago due to unknown reasons, June 30th, 1982. Everyone made it out alive, but one, the janitor, John Wade, his body was never found. Could the killer be John Wade out on revenge? Does he blame the victims for his death? Did he seem to like Madison? Why did he hate all the others? The school does still exist, untouched for a year. I'm gonna check it out. Oh my god! The horns! The French horns are getting me! I saw one where the hero has given his energy to pumpkins to turn them into princesses by the overthrow. Yeah, me too! Oh, the origin story! Okay. We can go inside there. Why would we though? Hello? Did you leave a disgusting gift again, John? No, I'm the janitor. It's literally my job to clean it. So this guy with the gold glasses, we actually killed him. We killed these two. Ew, he's so gross. Uh, stay out of the teacher's lounge, you freak. It's not very nice. Go clean the toilets, you idiot. Okay, so even the janitor's a piece of garbage to him. Hey, weirdo, clean this crap up. No. Morning, Mr. Wade. Loved your gift. Thank you. Right. Leave that girl alone, asshole. It's not very nice either. Ah, okay. Inspect the photo. You're my best friend, Madison. That's unhealthy. That's really unhealthy. Ah, my only friend. Man, go for a walk on a beach somewhere. 
Oh no! A fire has broken out and it wasn't us! Uh oh. Good thing we've got this clown mask, huh? Dude, you're setting the whole place on fire! God damn it, man! Just wanted to mess with him! Do we help the freak? Who cares, bro? Let's get out of here! Someone help me! Help me! Okay, so he's got to be like horribly disfigured at this point, right? But he lived! Meet your maker! Take 20! Okay. So I don't know if we were still like watching these these films or anything, or if uh, it actually happened or anything like that. Alright, set the traps. Okay. Un. Deux. Trois. Four in French. And of course five. Grab weapon. Sure, I'll grab a weapon. How about these nuts? But I grab these nuts. They're really heavy. Okay, we're gonna grab the sledgehammer. Our favorite weapon of all. Who was recording these tapes? Yeah, they could actually be movies. Or they could actually just be like films of him murdering people. Five minutes earlier. Oh, I don't know who to root for. I don't know who to root for. Shoot the lock. Okay, done. Who the hell do I root for? Okay. He might be in any of these little uh, holes here. There's a bear trap. Evade. Yes. And here. Evade. Yes. Evade. <coughs> yes. Two more. One. And the last one is over here. Evade. Good. Z, go inside. This must be where he is living. Wait, you keep streaming? I didn't know. Yeah, I always keep streaming. I just do like outros every time I, um, I uh, end a game itself. Looks like he went through that vent. Who took that shot? That was me. I took that shot. All right, I'm coming for you, detective. He's this way, and we need to Z him. We're gonna put him to Z. Oh, he hated that. Oh God. I hate this. Okay, there we go. We probably want to hold out here, don't we? And if we just kind of like, there he is, good. We'll kind of like do the old epilepsy flash. You know what I'm talking about? Good. Yep. You know what I'm talking about, right? 360 degrees of vision. The old epilepsy uh, flash. Good. Yes. Another shot right there. Oh, damn. He closed that gap fast. Wow. What time is your next stream going to be? It'll be next Monday, New Zealand time. And it will... Whoops. What do you mean? I am pressing Z. Oh, right. Okay. I don't know if he comes out of the vent or not. Okay, let's go ahead. Flip ourselves around. Good shot, me. Gonna fire again. Let's just be a little bit more tactical about this. There he is. Good. Because he can close that gap real fast. There he is. So instead of just kind of spinning around like an absolute oaf and then stop spinning, we'll, can, we'll look in the directions that he's coming in and then we'll shoot as soon as we see him. Which probably makes the most sense now that I say that out loud. All right, there he is. He's got his sledgehammer out. Oh my God! He closes that gap real fast. My time is spent 10.54 p.m. Didn't I already give you your time zone? Like, I went out of my way to find your time zone. It, it's hard to do as well, especially when you have to do it from incomplete data. Uh, just look up that comment where I told you your time zone. I think it was like plus one. Plus one GMT. It's actually, it's really important to know your own time zone, especially if you're going to be talking to people over the internet. All right, one right there. He closes the gap from that direction real fast. So we're going to get one from this side next. And this side, he closes it real fast. And then probably from this side. Right, he's just alternating now. Good. He juked me! What a guy! Oh! I'm at 7.55pm. It's, uh, it's pretty early comparative to everybody else here because we're on plus 12 GM GMT here in New Zealand. Our first major country to feel Christmas, too. All right, good. Wow, he's got some nuts. He's coming in from the, uh, the side that we're not really facing our torch in. Okay, we'll keep on flashing. Don't know where he's coming from that way. 
good. He is very, very uh, tricky when he starts closing that gap like that. That is hard to get. This next one's probably going to be harder. Yep, that is pretty damn hard. Oh, damn it, I faced the wrong way! The timing of this is so tricky. Is that a grass Chloe? I have no idea. All right, here we are. I'm gonna come over here. Shoot him. Good. I don't know where he goes. I don't know if he comes out of these doors or not. Bang. Good. We could probably go all the way to the end here and just see whether or not there's somewhere for him to come out of. Good. Good. I think he actually did just go into that hole right there. Damn that, oh, what the hell? Are you taking the piss? I shot him. He didn't run away. He just teleported onto the other side of me and then, okay, okay, game. All right, fine. All right, it's gonna close that gap real fast. I'm just gonna hold out here. Every time he comes at us, it's gotta be from that direction, right? Because we're at the edge of the map. We don't have a choice. I know there's a door right beside us. It's probably gonna bite us in the ass eventually. Uh, there he is. Good. One there. There he is, he's starting to close the gap real fast now. And he's coming in hot and heavy, I think. There he is. Good. We're literally backed in a corner and it's the best thing in the world. We still had haven't had our ass bitten off. Nice, we shot his dick off. And he's bleeding all over the hole right next to us. Woo! Yes! Well, did that investigation slick? Did your investigation slick? I'm sorry to tell you this, Mr. Powalski. But the body, it's gone. Penis and everything. The body is what now? The Happy Hills Homicide! This was a really cool little puzzle game. I actually really enjoyed this. This is so cool. Made by Daniel Vieding. Good work, Daniel Vieding. I can't read any of that. Thank you for playing. The end? Womp womp. <laughs> Ooh. And he slinks off into the shadows. Cool game. I don't know what they did. I don't know what any of the... Well, I kind of... They bullied him, right? They bullied him and they, they kind of created the creature of their own making. That's essentially the story. I was basically ready to say I don't know what the lore is, but we actually saw the lore in the high school. I just forgot it for a moment. All right. I'm not going anywhere, but I am going to end the physical recording that I'm making for YouTube so that the VODs don't go up in like 480p, which I think is what YouTube just kind of records them at and then sets the lives at. So... I am, I am still going to be here after the outro. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Right up here, you're going to find the playlist for the one and done spookers that I have made. And right up here, you're going to find another playlist that I think you'd really, really enjoy. Down in the description below, you are going to find a link to my Discord where you can talk with me and my community personally. And, of course, until I make the next episode or you catch the next live stream, hint, hint, I will see you later. Thank you so much for watching again, and goodbye!